Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars, and this is Disclosure, coming to you from the frozen tundra-like plains of sunny western New York State, in Sinus Valley, south of Rochester, north of Hell. And I wanted to show, I've actually uh, had this one pinned for some time, this area shows blatantly shows vegetation. If you're not seeing the vegetation in this one, you're blind. Get your eyes checked because this is so obvious that it's pathetic. It's contrasted against the white background and <laughs> come on folks. Anyway, so, well, I promise I will get to the buildings, by the way. Uh, actually, here's one of them now. I'd say this thing's rather fascinating, wouldn't you? It looks like an old building. There's even kind of a rectangular piece on top. Right there. So, I'm thinking, yeah, there's much more than we've been told. There's no thinking about it. You may have seen just a hint of what I'm about to show you uh, to the left. Well, uh, let's try to bring the view down a little bit, and... Looks like there's some uh, buildings right there in the uh, crater. It'd be kind of a logical place to build buildings, wouldn't it? Uh, sheltered. If that's what these truly are, are impact craters, sometimes I wonder how many really are impact craters. Uh, let's see. Now here we have something that's very interesting. And I'm going to give you the... We're going to go back to the above view for this one, because looks like more buildings to me. I can't seem to nestle them in sight in with uh, natural features, or perhaps they make them look like they're natural. I don't know. They're all nice and crisp and clear, and... all that, so, looks like uh, some sort of structures, I'm not going to spend a lot of time on those, and the fourth arrow, don't know what that is, I'm trying to figure that out yet. But again, here you have the vegetation. This is in the forest, like the other area I showed where there are obvious uh, pine trees sticking up. But, uh, it looks more like uh, lower brush land, that type of thing. So, Let's take a look at this area, which is the one I want to show you. I mean, besides these dugout-looking areas here. And some curious uh, things that are lined up right in a row. I 
How do you like that? I tend to think a lot of these features are uh, manifestations of things underground. That the Martians or somebody has built. See, Martians kind of tongue in cheek because I don't want to conjure up images of little green men. But anyway, here we go. Notice how these uh, things sit up vertically with ultra flat tops. Uh, folks, that is not natural. It's not natural at all. And then we get things like take a look at the arrow. Looks like a little building on top of these. An obvious building. I mean, need I go on? It looks more like a wall. But need I go on here? I mean, the straight up and down vertical on their sides. And they're flat on top. Natural geologic feature? Nope. Don't think so. This is very bizarre. Only th the only uh, downside of that is the uh, shapes aren't terribly geometric. But we have a lot of those here on Earth, so... That may not mean anything. But I mean, isn't this beautiful? Some sort of Martian architecture, probably. Now, I did take one snapshot of this. I'm warning you ahead of time, the quality isn't the greatest. Uh, I did try to... I tweaked the lighting, trying to bring out more details and have much in the way of success. But I'll show you what I have nonetheless. These are buildings... Well, it looks like a some sort of a community. So let's take a look at that. And hang on one sec. Okay, this is my mod of part of that area. We'll zoom in. These are buildings in my book. They may be old and decayed, I don't know. They may not be active. Seems like some of them have lights, so. And this is the uh, whole thing right here. These are buildings, people. A lot of buildings. That's right there on Google Earth. Coordinates. Seven fifty forty two South one nineteen twenty one thirty two fifty West elevation fourteen thousand four hundred and fifty three meters. So that's really high up. Well, that, that might be the uh, satellite height, I don't know. But anyway, getting the point here, there's so much artificial stuff on this planet, it's unbelievable. Uh, and I'm thinking that people don't care because you're tied up with the elections, you're thinking about elections, or you're thinking about partying, and... You don't care about the fact that there may be an alien civilization living right next door to you. There's no question in my mind that there was a civilization there. That I'm not ever going to dispute, having seen what I've seen. All right. 
that's the picture I took from it. It's not very good, but there's no question that we're seeing buildings. Well, I'll take one more look at this area, see if we can find anything else. I may have li ad living a lot of this stuff. Lots of times when I come on Google Earth, you're seeing what I'm seeing for the first time. I'll find the area and then I'll go over it with you together so it's not a prepared thing in many cases. Some cases it is. Basically, so basically this area has lots and lots of vegetation and what apparently is a small community or city or what have you with lots and lots of buildings I can't imagine mother nature accounting for something like this not when the walls are straight up and down and uh, they're flat perfectly flat on top I can't see that no way you may want to do your own analysis of this area, because it's got some really fascinating things. There appear to be some entrance ways there. Just get the coordinates from the video and go from there. Take a look at that er that area before I go. Something right there. Looks like uh, cross hatched pipes, to be honest with you. Definitely a feature, definitely artificial. So there you go. Uh, lots and lots of vegetation. A small city. All there out and open for people to see if you just bother looking. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.